Okay, let's bring the knight out. Let's attack the center. Let's take the knight, pawn, sorry. Let's grab the knight. Take the queen off the board, not messing with any technical business. Let's just bring the bishop out. And hit the bishop with it. No, you know what? I'm actually going to hit the bishop with the bishop. And take with the knight. They're moving real quick. So still in the opening stage, we could go and castle on the queen side, seeing as there's a little bit of um, damage done on the king side. So yeah, they're moving very quick. Let's just be steady. Give my bishop, my rook some air rather than blocking it off. It's going to get the knight. I'm going to get the knight here. Maybe uh, sitting it here, attacking the pawn. I'm going to bring the knight up. Got to 1 1 there. Obviously, it's simply defended because the rook comes here. We do have this, but then his bishop's there. So, can we do something about this situation? His king is on the other side of the board. It's gone in front where his castle is weak but it's only weak if we can do something about it interesting right let's bring the knight so we're going to start traversing over to the other side of the board tempted to not take but then he just pushes past let's go here let's attack but we're trying to make our way over to the other side of the board let's get over attacking this pawn get the bishop here Maybe attacking. Let's put a check on the king. Attacking the pawn twice. Take with the rook, maybe. Oh, I think we can take with the knight. We've got support from our rook. This fancy knight business, what's he doing? Okay, so this must be okay for us. Knight attacking the rook. Rook comes and attacks the knight. Knight takes the pawn. Okay, let's do that. Let's capture in. Oh, the bishop's got a pawn here. Let's move the rook first. Anything before I do, that's not, no, that's not right. Let's just take, got another pawn. It's not letting me have that. Could attack their knight. Anything else? No, rook up, there, that, fork. Go for a fork type thing. It's attacking all three of them. Rook's protected, so we can take the bishop for free or the knight for free. Bishop's already attacking this pawn here, so I'm going to take the bishop. And take with the king, fork time. No, nope, let's take with the king. Alright, so let's attack the pawn, shall we? Should really attack a higher peak. What am I doing? Going too fast. Let's take the pawn with the bishop. And let's take... Oh, they're giving pieces up now. Okay. What's he doing with the knights? Coming in here. Let's just attack the knight. I don't think there's much thinking needed, but let's just be steady. He's got two minutes. Don't need to move that way. Let's attack the knight. They should kind of really resign now, shouldn't they? Really, I don't think there's much that can be done. Yeah, I'm thinking just push. Just keep. I was coming for the pawn. Don't really want to give them anything, do we? It's just support with the king. Push. If we push one more, he can't get it, but he can get it from there. So let's attack the knight. Take the knight off the board. And he's going for a stalemate type thing. There's no stalemate just yet. So might as well push this pawn. Keep pushing and pushing. Keep pushing. Push with a check. It's got space, still space, lots of space. Push.
No, can't go there, can't go there. I can go backwards and forwards, so let's go. Put a little bit of checkmate on there. Excellent. 